With several high-profile deaths in the news the past quarter, we thought this might be a good time to remind you to update your beneficiary forms for your retirement accounts. It does not count if your heirs find a signed form on your desk that you forgot to turn in. Who can you specify as a beneficiary? You can specify your spouse, your children, your grandchildren, a trust, a charity, other people, or some mix of the above. If your spouse is still living, then you must get a spousal waiver to specify other beneficiaries. If you inherit a retirement account and are a designated beneficiary, then you have two options for liquidating the account. You can take distributions over your life expectancy, known as the stretch option, or you must liquidate the account within five years of the original owner's death. But you must start taking distributions from the inherited retirement account within a year after inheriting the account, even if you haven't reached the magic age of 70 and a half. You also must make sure that if the original owner was over 70 and a half, that a required minimum distribution was taken from the account in the year they passed. Spouses have special treatment under the tax code. They can roll the inheritance into their own retirement account and take distributions based on their life expectancy, and they can specify beneficiaries to inherit the account. What about setting up a trust? This can be a good way to pass on significant wealth. However, some custodians may have issues with the trust if they can't look through the trust to see the qualified beneficiaries, and the five-year distribution policy may come into effect. What happens if you leave the beneficiary form blank? It defaults to the estate of the account owner, and you are no longer a designated beneficiary according to the IRS. You no longer have the ability to stretch the distributions over your life expectancy. Instead, you must deplete the IRA within five years or using the IRA owner's life expectancy if they had already turned 70 and a half and started taking RMDs. The tax rules regarding beneficiaries are quite complex. Seeking the help of a professional estate planner to make sure your wishes are carried out is highly recommended.